Lake Powell Water Level Update, March 11, 2024. Welcome back to Exploration Earth. Today, we're setting our sights on a stunning natural wonder, Lake Powell, but with a focus on a concerning trend, its water levels. Lake Powell, a jewel of the Southwest. Nestled between Utah and Arizona, Lake Powell is a colossal artificial reservoir on the mighty Colorado River. Created by the Glen Canyon Dam, it's not only a breathtaking landscape but also a major vacation destination, attracting millions each year. But Lake Powell is more than just a playground. It's a crucial water storage facility for the upper basin states, Colorado, Utah, Wyoming, and New Mexico. This water is vital for millions of people and plays a significant role in the Colorado River Compact, ensuring a minimum flow to the lower basin states. Sadly, Lake Powell faces a significant challenge, declining water levels. This isn't new, but it's becoming increasingly concerning. Several factors contribute to this issue. One major culprit is the ongoing drought plaguing the southwest. Less precipitation translates to less water flowing into the Colorado River and, consequently, Lake Powell. Additionally, the Bureau of Reclamation reports an average annual loss of storage capacity due to sediment buildup. All that sand and silt from the Colorado and San Juan rivers settle at the bottom, reducing the lake's ability to hold water. The consequences of this shrinking water source are far-reaching. Exposed shorelines create an eyesore and disrupt the delicate ecosystem of the surrounding area. Recreational activities like boating become difficult or even impossible due to low water levels. Even more concerning, the declining water levels threaten the Glen Canyon Dam's ability to generate hydroelectric power, impacting millions who rely on it. So, what exactly are we looking at? As of today, March 11, 2024, Lake Powell sits at 44% of its capacity. That's a staggering drop, considering the lake's potential to hold a massive 24.3 million acre-feet of water when full. Interestingly, the current water level is very close to what it was just two days ago on March 9. This might seem insignificant, but small fluctuations can have a significant impact on infrastructure and usability. A glimpse of hope, recent snowfall, transition to visuals of snow-capped mountains. There's a glimmer of hope amidst these challenges. Recent snowfall in the upper Colorado River Basin has been above average. While it's too early to say for sure, a good snowpack could translate to increased water flow in the spring, potentially helping Lake Powell recover some lost ground. The future of Lake Powell is uncertain. Balancing water needs, environmental concerns, and the economic impact on tourism is a complex challenge. Sustainable water management practices, exploring alternative water sources, and re-evaluating water allocations are all crucial aspects of the solution. Here at Exploration Earth, we believe in responsible stewardship of our natural resources. Staying informed about water issues like the situation at Lake Powell is essential. You can make a difference. Research water conservation practices in your area. Support organizations working on water management solutions. Let your voice be heard and advocate for sustainable practices. Thanks for joining us on this exploration of Lake Powell's water levels. Remember, even small actions can have a ripple effect. Together, we can ensure a healthy future for this incredible natural wonder.